Isn't your brain asking what you will do in case of an asteroid attack? Does the thought of your existence being erased from Earth worry you at all? Descending straight from space, to be able to witness a shooting star is a thrilling phenomenon. But did you know that these shooting stars are in fact solid rock formations that get sucked towards planets due to their gravitational pull? These rocks more commonly known as asteroids are an old chip of the same block. Mostly in huge shapes and sizes, asteroids clash into the planets with immense speeds, leading to destruction. The last asteroid collision was some 10 years ago, and now from 2024 to 2880, NASA scientists have listed out the asteroids that could possibly hit Earth. Does this mean that humanity will soon go extinct like the dinosaurs? Welcome to Lab 360. It's time to explore. One of the most impactful asteroid collisions to have hit Earth was Tunguska Bolide in 1908. This occurred near the Podkamenia Tunguska River in Russia. The impact resulted in one half-ton chunk of about 1.5 meters of the asteroid landing into a frozen lake. Besides flattening an estimated 80 million trees over an area of 2,150 square kilometers of the forest. The Tunguska Bolide was one of the largest known atmospheric impacts Earth experienced since the Chicxulub impactor. Almost a century later, in February 2013, another asteroid crash occurred in Chelyabinsk, Russia. The asteroid, almost the size of a tennis court, crashed into Earth's atmosphere at nearly 70,000 km per hour, racing from southeast to northwest. The impact of this asteroid led to shattered windows all over the city injuring around 1,500 people because of the flying glass. When the asteroid blasted in the sky, it emitted energy equivalent to the detonation of about half a million metric tons of TNT. Just to put things into perspective, the Hiroshima bomb was over 15 kilotons on TNT and the Nagasaki bomb was 25 kilotons. Both these asteroids, immensely massive and powerful in nature, presented scientists with a learning curve to be prepared for the future. In fact, the Chelyabinsk size asteroid impact happens every 25 years or so, with most taking place over the ocean or wilderness. Now, NASA scientists have issued a warning about a lost asteroid, 2007, F, T, 3, floating through space holding minute chances of colliding with Earth this year. This asteroid is estimated to be between 0.266 to 0.594 kilometers in diameter, larger than 90% of asteroids but tiny compared to the larger ones. The NASA Center for Near-Earth Object Studies, also known as CNOS, which tracks the journey of an asteroid, has evaluated that it could potentially crash into Earth as soon as October 5, 2024. The 2007 F T 3 was last seen floating in space in 2007. As per NASA, 2007 F T 3 holds the probability of 0.000087% or 1 in 11.5 million chance of striking Earth. Another possibility of the same asteroid hitting Earth is as early as March 2024. Mind you, in either case the asteroid has the potential to release the energy equivalent to the detonation of 2.6 billion tons of TNT. However, another asteroid named 99942 Apophis, approximately 1,100 feet in width, is estimated to pass less than 20,000 miles from our planet's surface, making it visible to the naked eye. Apophis will be the asteroid that will be uncomfortably close to Earth in 2029. However, luckily it won't crash into Earth. For the year 2046, scientists are expecting two asteroid showers on Earth. Asteroid 2023, F, Z, 3, a 150-foot wide asteroid much like the size of an aeroplane, will just pass through Earth on April 6th. And, asteroid 2023 DW, 
which is the size of a swimming pool, may collide with Earth on Valentine's Day. However, it also has a 1 in 560 chance of hitting Earth. <laughs> Lastly, the asteroid that might crash into Earth in the year 2182 is Bennu. About one-third of a mile wide at its equator, carrying a mass of 78 billion kilograms, this asteroid is rich in carbon. Though Bennu passes close to Earth about every six years, it will first make a close flyby of Earth in 2135. But according to the data shared by the OSIRIS-RX spacecraft, there is a 1 in 2700 chance of this asteroid impacting Earth in September, 2182. If it does collide into Earth, it will do so with the force of 22 atomic bombs causing a destruction of up to 600 miles. Scientists are continuing to learn about the near-to-Earth asteroids to avert life-threatening collisions. If an asteroid impact were to happen, would we become extinct just like dinosaurs? Or will the remnants of these asteroids help us to better understand the origin of our universe? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. And be sure to subscribe to Lab360 for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated, and let's continue to explore together.